Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Autofill is a feature that allows Excel to automatically fill in a repeating pattern that you establish. For instance, you could fill in the months of the year, the days of the week, or any repeating numerical pattern. To do this, first select the cell or cells that establish the pattern. Then look for the fill handle in the lower right corner of the selected cell or cells. It is a small square in the lower right corner of any active cell or cell range. Move the cell selection cursor, which is the chunky white cross, towards this box and try and fit the upper left corner of the cross up into the lower right corner of the cell or cell range where the fill handle is located. When the cursor is in the correct place, it will turn into a thin black cross. This is the autofill cursor. Now just click and drag the handle out either horizontally or vertically to fill in the selected range. As long as the selected cell contains the beginning of a pattern that Excel recognizes, it will fill in the range with the rest of that pattern. The names of the rest of the pattern will appear in a screen tip as you drag over each cell. If Excel does not recognize the entry within the initially selected cell or cell range as establishing a pattern, then it will simply copy the first cell's contents into the rest of the cells that you select. Actually, this can be very handy if you simply want to copy the same cell entry over a range of cells. Excel will also recognize patterns that you establish. For instance, if you type the number 2 into a cell, and then the number 4 into the next cell, and selected both as a cell range, you could drag out the rest of this pattern by using the autofill handle, which would be increasing by 2. After you click and drag the autofill handle, you may see the autofill options tag appear next to your selection. If Excel did not establish a pattern or established the incorrect pattern, you can click this button and then choose the fill series option or one of the other available options to force Excel to try and recognize the pattern that you select. This may occur if you initially selected an ambiguous cell value, such as the number 1 as your starting cell value, for example. In this case, Excel will default to simply copying the value. You can click the Autofill Option Smart tag and then choose the Fill Series option in order to change the copied value to values that increment by 1. This can also occur when using date values. If Excel doesn't choose the desired method of incrementation for the date values, you can often choose the desired method from the Autofill Options Smart tag. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.